all right guys so today i am pulling wire and i need to tie all these four wires together so that i can pull it in the conduit so i'm going to show you how to make a, a wire pull head now this is going to be for smaller wire this is a uh, three three gauge thhn wire with a number eight ground um this head that i'm going to show you will work for short pulls with not a lot of bends um, but there's another way that you want to tie on large wires for really hard pulls but this is more than sufficient for a short pull uh, with smaller wire so the first thing i'm going to do is set you down where you can see me and I'm gonna get my tape and I'm gonna start with my green wire so I'll lay the rest of those down I'm gonna start with my green wire so I've got this roll of old green tape that I'm gonna use and what you want to do is you want to start right about here that leaves you room to put the loop on the end of the fish tape or rope or whatever you're using then you just want one thin wrap all the way back i'll show you how far to go you just want one thin wrap so we'll get this wrapped up here about I don't know about 10 inches to a foot nice and thin and the reason we're putting this wrap on the bottom is so that there is a long section that's glued to this center, this green wire this is going to be the center of our wire pull head so we want to make sure that it's stuck to it really good now I'm going to grab these wires one at a time and start adding them to this uh, pulling head So first, I'm going to bring this wire up to, you can see it here, up to the end of that green tape. And back here where my tape is at, what I want to do is just put a couple wraps on here to get it started. You want to make sure your wire is nice and straight. I'm going to put a couple wraps on here to get it started. Now I'm going to add another wire. So I've got this one started. Now I'm going to add another wire. So I grab my orange wire. Now what you want to do is you want to stagger the ends of them. So see how far back that orange is? Right about there is where you want it. So then, then you'll put a couple wraps on it. So I'll go ahead and put a couple wraps on it. I'm gonna try to keep them nice and tight together. A couple wraps on here. Now I'm gonna add my last wire. You can do this with as many wires as you have. You just put one, add a little tape, put one, add a little tape. Now this one, we're gonna stagger back a little farther. So, we'll get it staggered back like that. Keep them nice and nice and tight together. Now we're going to finish this out. This is the last wire I got to add. So essentially what that's done is that's put one continuous piece of tape from beginning to end through this pulling head. So the likelihood of this slipping is very low. Now, whenever you get to these corners, like this right here, you want to make sure that you get plenty of tape on it so it's not sharp. That way it don't catch on nothing. I wrapped that three or four times. I'm going to do the next one the same way. I'm going to stop on it. See how I stopped on it there? I'm going to wrap it again. And then I'm going to move on down. 
I'm going to do the same thing with the last one. I want it to be almost sloped. Now, once you get once you get the last one, it ends right there. Once you get the last one wrapped, you want to come up about a half inch and you're done. That's kind of like putting the seal on it. Break your tape, and we'll see what we got now. So here's what we ended up with. We've got our green in the center. That's our that's our first our first one that we added. And as you can see, how our wire steps. We added our first one back here. We added our first one back here. Then we added our next one. Then we added our last one. And we wrapped it all up together. That's what it should look like. Now what I'm going to do is just stick that piece of wire. I'm going to stick this green wire. Let me get my camera to focus here. I'm going to stick that green wire right in the end of the fish tape and bend it over and put some tape on it and that's going to be good enough. And I promise you that, that wire head right there will not come loose. Will not. On an easy pull. Now if you've got 700 degrees worth of bends it ain't going to go. But Hopefully y'all found this useful. Uh, try out this wire pulling head. And uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all our future videos. Thanks and have a great day.